Okay, so today we're going to unbox our very first paint okay. machine. Let's go get it. Be right back. All right. As you can probably tell, this is a definitely a heavy box. It says this side up. Let's see how well this is packaged. It is snowing outside, by the way. We're here in Virginia. It's a beautiful day in here. So, if you know the Bearded Pickers channel, you know he also bought one of these as well. Well, hello, boys and girls. Um. <laughs> Let's see how this one's packaged. And if you do get a chance to visit his channel, it's the Bearded Picker. He also has the Bearded Picker Live as well. So, if you get a chance to go watch his stuff, he's really informative when it comes to Amazon FBA, things to do with selling on eBay. And he is a little funny sometimes. See if y'all can figure out if this is Bigfoot. Most of the time he's way too serious. Just thinking about that part. But anyways, <laughs> uh, let's get into opening this up. Who wants to guess how it's packaged? What are we gonna find? Let's find out. We noticed that you did in fact, or someone did in fact, pack it with paper tape. What do you know? So what do we know from this? He doesn't have a thermal printer. All right, here we go. Well, what do you know under there? Regular plastic tape. I wonder, makes me really wonder whether FedEx might have repackaged this box. Oh goodness. This doesn't look good. Is that a ceiling tile? I think it is. There is not nearly enough packaging in here, and this box is way too big. You know what this guy needs? He should have used one of these. It's a box resizer. If this box would not have been so big, it wouldn't have tumbled around. But we don't know yet whether it's in good condition or not. But let's not judge before we find out. He could have easily cut three or four inches off of that box. I'm gonna go with, this is at best, a five packing job at this point. Would have done anything, which I doubt they did. They're disgusting. They're dirty. I really don't think you want that in your electronics, especially not a paper, a paper tape machine. I'm gonna cut the side of this box down. Yeah, there's definitely a lot of dirt, I call it. If you see these right here, not a single one of those bubbles still exists. They are completely popped. Wonder how many times this machine has been dropped today. But let's see if it survived. More packing on the side. I'm gonna have to vacuum in here when I get done. Do you see something else that's wrong? They definitely marked this box as up this side. There's three stickers there. This machine is entirely upside down in here. Well, there it is. There's the water canister. Looks like a new cord. Let's get rid of this box so we will carefully lift this thing out of here. It is heavy. It is very heavy. Like I said, it is disgustingly dirty. Probably mostly from peeling tile being in there. There we go. We lean that back. And we've got... Alright, so that tells, tells us right here where how to do this. So it's over the roller in the back, over the roller right here, under this roller here. Alright. How well do you think this tape works? I think that's the... Alright, before we're going to do anything else, we're going to download this manual and uh, then we'll hook it up. We gotta figure out where these go. It's clearly labeled that it goes somewhere. So we're gonna find out. We're gonna read the manual. Go right there. Slot it down. And it basically has some rivets. Alright, so before we do anything else, we are going to download this manual. Uh, this water, this 
dispenser sits right here on the side. All right, so until we come back, uh, we'll do a test of this uh, once we download the manual. Overall, horrible packaging. I'm giving maybe three out of 10 packaging. It was in a box, that's one point. That's a bubble wrap, probably another point. At this point, I'm not sure that anything is broke. I'll give it another point for that one. I also haven't verified that it's working, obviously, but uh, it definitely was in upside down. That's definitely not good. Um, it wasn't secured. The box was too big. If, it, if the box had been cut down, it would have kept it from falling over. So, anyways, so that's what we're gonna go with for now.